and welcome back to the channel on this video I want to talk about the ride one up cafe cruiser as you see it right here and the reason why I want to talk about this bike today is because I just want to remind everybody that ride one up has uh, some terrific sales going on right now and this is just one of the bikes that they have uh, on sale uh, I will leave a link in the description if you want to go and check out the other ones I mean, they have anything from the Rev 1, which are very popular, uh, to the Prodigy, to the Rift, to this Cafe Cruiser. Take your pick, and uh, great time to be buying a bike um, before the prices uh, start to rise. And uh, we are uh, approaching Father's Day uh, coming up here. So, uh, nothing better than to get your dad, or maybe yourself, a new cafe cruiser or another bike so I'm gonna go over a couple of things about this bike quickly first of all the price right now um, depending on which model you buy the step through or step over and the color so they're going for either 1095 or 1045 uh, like I say depending on the color and the model that you choose and uh, outstanding prices. I mean, I, I've had this bike for several weeks now and uh, I can't say enough about it. If you're not uh, wanting to break the bank on a bike, you just want one that's gonna perform well, um, it's a class three bike, uh, I think this may be the bike for you. It weighs 65 pounds, so you don't have a great big um, heavy bike to deal with. It's nice and easy to maneuver and all that. It's got 26 by three inch tires. It's got the 750 watt sustained rear hub motor there. It's a 750 watt sustained, 48 volt. It's got hydraulic brakes, a nice wide plush seat right here that I can tell you is very comfortable for me. I like the swept back handlebars that you see right here. And here's what the bike looks like in the front. And it does have the front fork uh, um, suspension, but no rear suspension. But what it does have that's really nice is it has the back rack, uh, which is integrated right into the frame. And this is really nice. And you can get a basket uh, for it uh, or a seat and ride a, a rider up to 150 pounds on the back, which is really nice. And like I say, it is a uh, class three, so the top speed is 28 miles per hour. With pedaling, I have it headed up as high as 33 uh, miles per hour. And um, with throttle, it's 20 miles per hour, so pedal assist is 28. But you can unlock the throttle and go uh, up to 28 miles per hour. I did do a video uh, several weeks back on how to unlock the throttle. Uh, to go to 28 miles per hour so uh, i can leave a link in the description if you want to uh, check that out on how to unlock the throttle to go 28 miles per hour so you can either do pedaling or throttle or maybe you want to do both i like to pedal but i like the throttle to get started um, once i get going then i i like to pedal so it gets me started uh, the throttle does so that's a look at the Cafe Cruiser. And now let's take it for a little ride. I should mention too, it's got, although they're dirty at the moment, uh, it does have the metal fenders as you hear the tapping of my fingers on it. It does have a rear uh, tail light and a headlight right there. The, unfortunately, it doesn't have a brake light. If I had to pick something that I didn't like, I don't like the fact that it does not have a brake light because I think all bikes should have a brake light as well as turn signals it doesn't have those and i think all bikes should but that's just my opinion this seat is a quick release seat uh too i should mention right there and you can uh, lift it up or down very easily um, to whatever height you choose to have it at so let's go for a ride and talk a little bit more like I say, it's not just this bike that they have on sale. You got to check it out. There's all, many of their models are on sale right now. Uh, and uh, this is the best time to take advantage because bikes are 
Prices are going to be going up very shortly, and I can tell you right now, I'm recording this video on June the 10th, Monday afternoon here, right around noon, and uh, I already looked on a one website today to see what's going on with prices, and it was uh, Aventon, and they've already raised their bike prices, it looks like, by $200, so um, this is a a great uh, sale that uh, Ride One Up has going on and uh, if you can and you're looking to buy a bike take advantage plus it's free shipping as well I didn't mention that um, several models as I say do I uh, choose from I'll put a link in the description for Ride One Up uh, their website um, to check any of those out and also I have a direct link to uh, this bike or the Rev1 uh, if you want to go directly to those and I also have a, a link a direct link that will take you to the uh, the basket that you can buy for this bike on the rear it's uh, $60 but yeah it's uh, it's that time of year that uh, if you're going to get a bike if you're deciding on getting one you want to get one now because you want to take advantage of the uh, ride season because depending on where you are Let's face it, the ride season for some people isn't all that long, right? Because if you're not a fan of riding in the colder weather, the wet weather, or you don't want to ride in snow or anything like that, and you only want to ride in the nice weather, then, like I say, depending on where you are, summers can be not that long. So uh, luckily here we have Decent weather that, um, if you don't mind riding in the rain, uh, then you can you can go quite a ways into the season. But this bike is really nice. It's. Uh, easy to handle I mean it's not it doesn't feel like a great big heavy clumsy bike or anything it's nice um, it pedals nice and easy it gets you out and enjoying the outdoors and I don't know I think riding a bike just makes makes you feel really good when you're riding Especially on a day like today, this is totally awesome. So the uh, weight capacity for this bike, the uh, payload capacity is 350 pounds. And with the bike only weighing 65, That leaves quite a bit of weight for the riders. So if you're a big rider, big heavier uh, rider, um, this will accommodate you. The uh, swap back handlebars give it that kind of that old school look, which I really like. I like the uh, look of this bike, the style. Uh, I guess it's to each their own on that, but I kind of like this. It, I like the positioning for the seating. I don't want to be hunched over. I want to sit more upright. And with the handlebars the way these are, it does give you that upright positioning. So uh, you feel, at least for me, I feel nice and comfortable riding. And this bike just rolls along nice and easy. It's it's it does really well too for uh, uh, for for getting off here with the uh, throttle there, the thumb throttle. It's on the left, which is a bit different, but 
once you get going I like to use that to start me off at from a stop and uh, it gets you going there and then you just start pedaling and my favorite pedal assist level and you've probably heard me say it so many times but you can see right there I like it right there on pedal assist level three that's a nice comfortable ride that'll take you anywhere from you'll be anywhere from the 16 miles per hour to 18 miles per hour I think something like that maybe 20 but just just nice and easy this bike is nice and easy to to ride it's a joy see I'm not even giving a lot of effort and I'm just pedaling nice and comfortably you feel like you could pedal all day you know and it's 15.7 miles per hour or so if you're doing any hill climbing then the nice thing about this is it has five pedal assist levels and what I do is when I'm going up a, a, you know, a big hill then I uh, go to the highest level I crank it up to five pedal assist five I'm in gear eight too I should mention that which is the highest gear you can uh, set it at and so I just put it to that and then uh, uh, gear five on the hills and it just nicely goes up there So that's a look and a little bit of a ride on the Ride One Up Cafe Cruiser. Like I say, if you want to check this out, uh, I will leave a link in the description and you can go and check out their website for this or any other bike that they have there. Um, they have several on sale right now. Uh, and I do have a direct link uh, for this bike, the Cafe Cruiser. I have a link for the uh, Rev One. And then I also have a link directly for the basket. And then there's just a link in there to take you right to the Ride One Up website, uh, my affiliation link. So if you do purchase a bike or, or, or a accessory there, then um, it does help out the channel a little bit. So uh, much appreciated if you are interested in doing that. So once again, Thank you for joining me on this video of the Ride One Up Cafe Cruiser and talking a little about, bit about their sales in Ride One Up. Let's take a one more look at the bike here. This car is not turning, it's not. So there it is in the beautiful sunshine. So that's going to do it for this video. If you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel, thank you very much for doing that. Just hit the subscribe button. If you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel, just hit that notification bell and you'll be notified. And if you want to leave a comment on this or any other video, go ahead and leave that in the comments below. And once again, thank you for joining me on this video. And until next time, keep your wheels on the road. See you later.